The Labrador breed is one of the top five most popular dog breeds in the world, it is a truly universal breed with a good disposition, excellent mind, and excellent working qualities, for which these dogs are often chosen as an assistant by hunters, rescuers on the water and in the mountains, for their excellent scent Labradors often serve in the police or at customs, and for their soft sociable nature. This breed is even used in rehabilitation centers and nursing homes for communication and mowing leisure. Labradors are also the best guide dogs for the blind and nannies for small children. The Labrador, or more correctly the Labrador Retriever, is a dog breed that was originally bred as a hunting gun dog, but then, thanks to its friendliness and wonderful character, gained popularity in many other areas. According to the owners of these dogs, the Labrador is the best breed of dog to keep in a home with children. It is difficult to find a more intelligent, devoted, and kind creature with a complacent character. The Labrador will be a great friend for both a single person and a married couple with children. The history of the Labrador Retriever breed can be traced back to the 19th century, at that time on the island of Newfoundland there was a breed of dog called the Little Newfoundland. These small dogs were faithful companions of the fishermen, helping the fishermen pull the fishing nets ashore, and sometimes saving the fishermen's lives. The Englishman Peter Hawker brought several of these dogs to Great Britain in the 30s of the 19th century, and later these dogs were crossed with other breeds, the curly-coated retriever, the English foxhound and the setter, as a result of which the modern dog breed, the Labrador Retriever, was born. The first official breed standard was established in 1887. In 1903, only black Labradors were recognized by the English Kennel Club, at the end of the 20th century, yellow became the acceptable color for Labrador retrievers, and a little later, chocolate. On the territory of the countries of the former Soviet Union, the first Labradors appeared in the late 60s and early 70s of the XX century. There are disputes about the origin of the name of this breed of dogs, to this day. The two most popular versions are that the dogs were called Labradors because the black color of their coat was similar to Labradorite stone, and the other version of Labradors was named so because the dogs may be home to Labrador Island in eastern Canada. Labrador dog with golden character. Kind by nature, without a trace of aggression or excessive timidity. The Labrador is a very friendly, open, and cheerful dog who treats the family in which he lives with great love. No wonder the Labrador is included in the rating of the most devoted breeds to man. The Labrador is not characterized by an aggressive attitude towards people and animals. He is good with other pets, including cats and other dogs. The Labrador has an affectionate and calm nature. Due to its benevolence towards strangers and strangers, constant readiness for new acquaintances and communication, the Labrador is not suitable as a guard. The Labrador is a very mobile, sometimes even hyperactive dog, he does not tolerate loneliness, he should not be left alone for a long time. A Labrador will never bark just like that, but he will definitely react to any suspicious noise. It is not for nothing that the Labrador takes the fourth place in the list of the smartest dog breeds in the world. This is a very smart, insightful, and obedient dog, the Labrador easily perceives training in training. Even a not very experienced owner can handle raising a smart and obedient pet. With the right upbringing, this is a very obedient dog. It should not be forgotten that the Labrador is a hunting dog. This is a good and passionate hunter, a dog with excellent instincts, with a soft grip, that is, the ability not to crush the game when serving. In addition, the Labrador has a real passion for water and bathing. The Labrador will enjoy bathing and playing in the water either in the bath at home or in the river or pond. Only with birds, because of the hunting instincts, a Labrador can have a difficult relationship. The Labrador Retriever is an unpretentious large breed that was bred to help and serve people. These pets are obedient, cheerful, loyal, fearless, and savvy. Previously, Labradors were often used for hunting, but now they are used mainly as companions and family dogs.
kind, obedient and energetic Labradors are also very much appreciated by many hikers. These dogs are distinguished by their poise and strength. Just like sheepdogs, Labradors can carry their own food in special backpacks because they are large dogs. Because of their versatility, people often take them on rafting trips. Labrador retrievers have a unique water-repellent coat on which water does not linger, which is very important in field conditions. The Labrador retriever is an active dog that accompanies its owner anywhere and everywhere with great pleasure. When traveling, the Labrador will become a faithful companion that does not cause problems and will even help to drag the load. Smart, good-natured and playful dogs get along well with children, and sometimes even play the role of nurse. When a small Labrador appears in the apartment, he will need maximum attention and careful care. There should always be someone from the family nearby. With the baby you need to play, treat goodies. Pick up only when necessary, carefully, but firmly picking up under the chest, you can't pull, let alone lift it by the paws, they can be easily damaged. A puppy should not be kept in the dark for a long time, this will upset the psyche and cause a number of diseases, including rickets. Before all vaccinations are done, the puppy should not be taken outside. Outdoor shoes should be hidden at this time, he can catch an infection just by licking them. Starting a Labrador, you will get a true friend, always ready to rush to the rescue of the owners. The reliability of the breed is evidenced by the fact that Labradors are often used as guides for the blind. Until the age of three, Labradors are mobile and playful, so care includes active games and walks for at least two hours a day. They slowly grow up psychologically, it is up to three years that they essentially remain puppies, so the owners need to be prepared for pranks and pranks. The breed is friendly and non-confrontational, obedient, easy to train, relatively easy to care for. A properly educated dog will never shit at home. Directly for the apartment, the Labrador is also good because it does not bark for no reason and does not disturb the neighbors. It can be left with children, as practice shows, harm can be done to the dog sooner than the dog will show some kind of aggression. The Labrador is categorically not suitable for keeping on a chain or in an aviary, but in an apartment he feels quite comfortable. Thank you friends for watching to the end, your support in the form of likes is very important to me, so it's time to click this button. Also write in the comments what breed you have, what breeds you like the most, and what breeds you want to see new videos about. Well, that's all for today, thank you all for watching, if it was interesting, support the video with likes, thank you for subscribing, and take a look at what else we have prepared for you.